with Podcast and Chill Network. We are offering a chance for two people. No, no, no. Hey, what does it say? Hey, hey let me know. Ghost lady, is that you? Uh, yes. <laughs> no, it's like I'm seeing myself. Ghost lady, is that you? No. Hmm? What would have happened to hey. us? All right. Nah, guys. Nah, what would have happened? Um, na, we call Stanley Twain. Guys, really? So, the starter is not much low anymore. Hey, you're late. So, you're late. Uh, you're late. Hey, for sec. So, so. Hey, for sec. I find you in the pub. If I am fine, if I am fine. She doesn't rip Swazi, eh? Like, you'd think she's from SA if you didn't know. She buys pre rolls. <laughs> <sighs> Aye, so we need an intervention now. Aye, aye, so. oh. aye we need an intervention. What are you doing? Aye, aye, aye. What are you doing? Second week in a row, you are late. Nah, come on. Nah. You know I had a flight from Kabecha. Nah. You know I had a flight from nah. Kabecha. What, ha- what happened? What yeah. happened? What happened? I had a flight Black, from Kabecha. The oh. studio has been waiting for so long. They even white studio now. Away, <laughs> away. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Showing you true colors. Scully says, Scully is on lap. Scully is on lap. No, man, you know Kabecha, dog. Hey, yeah. How was it? How was it? No one is the whole TV show about Kobeka. It's lit, though. It's lit. It was brilliant. I was playing there last week. It's amazing, man. The love is amazing. The love is so real. It's crazy, man. You know, the love is real. It's... But uh, uh, Kofi, shout out to Kofi, man. And by the way, shout out to fucking DJ Choice. Because he always, you know, hooks us up nice oh, yeah. nice. Uh, with the Kofi gigs. I don't know. What does he do? What does Choice do at Kofi? I think he's the one who books all the artists. Yes, yes, but like, what's his? So he's the booking agent, I agent, know. or but yeah, they use him, man, and like choice, choice. Remember choice? Yeah, I remember. Yeah, yeah, but why are you late? Why are you late? <laughs> why are you late? No, the flight, bro. You know, flight. <laughs> <He's> a, <laughs> I, I, I spoke to Spoo, You landed at four, bro. We landed. No, we landed at four. But yes, landed at four. Mm. How trained? Right, it's Saturday. Mm. The Khao train leaves the intervals in like 30, 35 minutes. Had to wait for 30 minutes for the train, mm. right? Mm. Waited. Now, when you Khao train, I'm going to Rosebank. Um, ah, man. <laughs> I'm going, I'm going oh, home. Oh, Town. <laughs> yes, oh. I'm going to Hillbro, Pop Town. <laughs> okay, okay. So now, then what delayed me again is you need to get off at, um, at in Santon and connect. Right, mm. um, the, the train because the train between the Khao train between uh, from the airport only goes to Santon and then yeah. you go to Pretoria wherever. When I got there, then I waited now the twenty minutes for the train to arrive. People who use the Khao train, especially from the airport, will tell you. So now it's five o'clock. Yes, now it's five o'clock. Sure. Right, the train arrives. I get home half past five. Mm. I literally just take the change. I didn't even change. Get in the car. Come here. Arrive at six. I live thirty minutes away. Oh, okay. Literally, oh, literally. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So what I should have done, though, what I should have done, um, and I'm like, fuck, what a stupid decision. I should have just Ubered Uber straight, straight from there. Yeah. So you, you were coming from straight. Yeah, yeah we, we thought we were coming here straight. But how's yeah. Kabecha though? Oh, Kabecha, 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 Kabecha was amazing, man. Yeah. Kabecha nice. was amazing. Yeah. Had so much fun there. Um, I went to the ocean. Okay. Now nah, it's weird. So, um, dude, hey, white people are up to no good. So these old white people, right, go to the beach in the morning. It's, it was fucking cold. Go there, and just before sun, and they go in the water, and just before sunrise, they all leave. 
Because the blacks are coming. No, not even. I don't think so. I think it's just like maybe some, uh, uh, not a ritual per se, but... You know, it's you know, it's, it's good to be in the ocean. You know, that's why we use bath salt, for example. You know, uh, when we when people bath and stuff. You know, because it, it it replenishes the skin and you know it, it's good. It's good. So yeah, white people are are, are aware of like you know. It's so Wait, weird. I don't, I don't get it. So they leave and then what's the? What's I just the found deal? it fascinating. Yeah. I, I found it fascinating. Yeah. It's got cleansing abilities, man. The ocean, you know, it's yeah. good um, for for just and everything. So they do that. It looks like it's a ritual. I Maybe you should so use it. Then you'll be on time. Yes. <laughs> then I'll make time stop. Right. I'll, I'll control time, <laughs> and, and I'll be father time. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> That's what make. And then I go home and say, "Come here, I'm going Friday or Sunday." Hi, hi, hi. That's good. <laughs> no, yeah. for Friday. So whenever never... Mac is inconveniencing a weekend is away. We record Friday or Saturday. Maybe now I'm having to you know, propose it on Friday or Sunday. But what, time did, early, you, what did you what time did you leave on Friday? <laughs> Yesterday. Yes. At one. Oh, okay. Why? Yeah, no, that was too early though. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. The flight was also early, yeah. so maybe if you're leaving later in the like the evening or the night, maybe then would have recorded. Yeah. Like, yeah. Hey, guess who inboxes me? Right? Hey, guess who inboxes me? Hey, inboxes me. I see tra. I'm like tra. I'm like how in this tra. Hey, but now it's a podcast thing. He's going around all the podcasts. Hey, hey, tra. You know tra. Oh yeah, yeah, not tra. Yeah, 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 yeah. So he asked to come to. We're recording with him on Tuesday. Yes, yes, yes. Because he had asked, and I think we're gonna get. Um, what's he famous for? That interview. So what? What? What is? What? Like? What's his? I think it's a. Oh, he's claimed to famous that interview. But it's an ex-offender. Ex, yeah, it's an, an ex-offender. Yeah, it's yeah. an ex-con, I think. Hey, people love those shows, eh? Yeah, they, yeah, ex-offenders. Yeah, they love it. It's fascinating. Everybody's fascinated by by criminals or former criminals or people who've committed crime. Mm. I mean, look at Tabo Besta. If you drop the book now, you'd buy it. Hey, did you see? Remember you posted in the group, you like, you see, had we leaked out who was behind all of this? Yeah, yeah. It's Bonilla, one of the investigators, um, the, one of the lead investigators. She's the head of um, organized crime in Free State. Literally left the courtroom and killed himself. Imagine. Yeah. But he killed himself because really, apparently it was in the car or something, but it was in public. Mm. But why? Doesn't it make you think? We made the right choice, guys. And it, it was the day Nandipa, because um, she had put an application to deem her arrest, deportation, and incarceration illegal or unlawful. And she failed um, in that application. It was on that day when she failed in that application, off themselves. Because we had to make a decision, it goes, lady, on yes. that day. Uh, Uri, okay, do we break the story? Because had we posted that episode, we would have broken the story. And like... Every outlet, news outlet would have been calling us and all that stuff. Exactly. So you think we made the right decision by not posting? Because I meet chillers all the time. They're like, ah, you guys should have posted. Yeah, people still posted. call us names and cowards mm. um, yeah. in the mentions. But what would have happened to us? It. Hmm? What would have happened to hey. us? I... Nah, guys. <laughs> nah. What would have happened? Um, na, we caused Stangy to end. <laughs> we caused nothing was going to happen to you. Because... You, you're not to be found anywhere. Yeah, but it would have been someone who was making those allegations and speaking, not yeah. you guys. And we're the vessel, right? We yeah. were the outlet. Uh, yeah. And then and it's it not was... like they can use you and bring you to court to. Okay, like, okay, go witness. live. Yeah, go live on Instagram <laughs> and speak. Oh. Anyway, and now, what I mean, ladies and gentlemen, we are back. What's up, Padukas? Yeah. Black Studios, yeah. Ghost Ladies, yeah. Fat Checkers, yeah. Sam Pewan is, yeah. I don't know what happened between uh, the last episode and today, but Makazi is confirmed. Uh, Makazi's nice. coming. Yeah, she's coming. Nice. Sunbed Arena, 30th of July. For the 10, we, we booked her for the 10 rand. She accepted the 10 rand. Yeah, she accepted, yeah, she accepted the... the 10 rand. Okay. And she cancelled. She was meant to be in Europe. She had a UK tour. Oh, so she cancelled a UK tour just for us. Uh, Whoa, Makazi. 
Makazi, yeah. look at that. Yeah. Thank you, Makazi and team. Yeah. Wow, brilliant. Also, man. big shout out to Tebani, Kasane, and Kuma Mashau. Uh, they won. Yeah. 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 They won uh, the tickets to Umpa Pops' show, Ooh. which you guys are going to later after. Yeah. Right? Are you going to Umpa Pops' show? I can't make it. Where are you going? Um, no, Lindhead. What does that Hi, mean? Hi, boy. Um, like Push. there's a funeral tomorrow, so it's the um, night vigil. Night, night vigil. vigil, Baba. Oh, we. Foslo. Oh, so you're going back to Foslo? Yeah. Who passed oh. on? Uh it's a it's a mate's mate's parent. Oh. Yeah. Oh, okay. shame, man. So congratulations to say the name, please. Um, tell me, say ni. Nebani. 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 And Mashal. And Mashal. And, Mashal. and Kuma Mashal. Kuma yeah. Mashal. So hey, this Kuma. week, listen, this one. Oh, yeah. This is a nice one, right? Yeah. So the incentive this week, if yeah. you buy a ticket to Road to 1 million, 30th yeah. of uh, July at Sunbed Arena, this is what's happening. Thanks to our friends in the Mixed Lounge, right? We are offering a chance for two people. No, no, no. Hey, what does it say? Hey, hey let me do Ghost lady, is that you? <laughs> yeah, yes. Yeah, it's like I'm seeing myself. Ghost lady, is that you? Whoa. Okay, let me just read it. Ah. Okay. <laughs> nice in the Mixed man. Lounge is offering you a chance to win two double tickets worth 3,900 rands for an unforgettable experience at the Durban July. Whoa! With the exclusive In the Mixed Lounge marquee. So when you get a ticket, each ticket will get you one race course entrance, one entrance ticket to the marquee, uh, complimentary drinks, and Chateau Terry boards on arrival. What is that? What? What? Chateau Terry? What is that? Oh, What's that? Ghost you, you, you fancy. It's, 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 it's food. It's oh, like is it canapes. Food? I think so. I think it's a like canopy. You know canopies like Canopy of F N. Eh eh cannot say canopy. Canopy. No, no, canopies. Can it's I? like food that comes in, you know, it's not like a full meal, I... but it's like it's just finger foods. Finger foods. Yes. Finger yeah. foods, yeah. Yeah. So it's uh, a board with just options of food. And to win, all you have oh. to do is buy a ticket for our Road to One Million event. Post on Instagram and Twitter, tag us with the hashtag Road to One Million. R O A D. T O one million, and you could be the lucky winner. T's and C's apply. Don't miss out on this incredible opportunity. Obviously, you have to get yourself to Durban, uh, to Durban. Oh, okay. But we will sort out the experience for you. Oh, we've got chillers in Durban. Then does that we, mean we are going to just... Durban July? Hey, does that mean we're going to Durban July? Yeah. Oh, we're playing at the marquee. Oh, yeah. We're yeah, doing yeah. a brunch on Sunday. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Come on, here, come smooth, smoother, smoother. Yeah. Dope. Explain oh, what's happening. Oh, what are we doing oh, at Durban oh, July? Oh, oh. Come, come, smooth. Legend! <laughs> what a legend! Smooth, correct? What is that legend? What did you do? 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 What stays? Uh, what come on! Oh, no, I wanna stays in the back. I wanna know. know. I know you mean it. Ah, ah, smooth. Ah, smooth siso. Ah, you mbone no smooth siso zolo. Mbone no smooth siso. But it's not funny if you don't tell us what happened, dog. And I want no, smooth. Like, smooth must come to your mic so so, say, so people can see smooth. Action essay, you know. <laughs> smooth like action, like yeah. So you got you got roadkill. Hmm? You got roadkill. Oh! Kills, kills, ah. kills, not one kill. Kill it. Many kills. Is that oh. okay? Umbulani. Hi, Umbulani. Hi, Anna Umbulani. I can't turn you for some. He's got bodies. He's got bodies. Hey, you know, be on the hotel. Ha, smooth. I just want to be on camera. I want smooth to be on camera so people see him. Yeah, cocktail. I want to know it. Yeah, I want to. Ah, funny. Yeah, hey, yeah, 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 that was smooth yesterday, man. <laughs> I love you on the road, it's smooth. Oh, <laughs> anyway, wow. I, I don't know, did you guys see, um, there's a lady who went on Twitter and she posted that she's HIV positive. Okay. Um, and she mentioned the list of all the guys that she slept with. Mm -hmm. Like oh. raw. Like she's just out there spreading. Famous stuff. guys. Uh, I don't know if they're famous. Uh, Fair checker, please pick that thing, that story up. You guys didn't hear about that? 
Mm-hmm. Wasn't it the he, made, so he mentioned the Nigerian men that she sleeps with, right? It was speculated that mm-hmm. some of them are Nigerian because mm-hmm. they saw the name Flaco. Flaco is a boyfriend to a very famous influencer, KMs. Um, oh. But she didn't go on to Twitter. She actually went on to the salty DMs and wanted to be anonymous where she basically did state that she was tested HIV positive and she's sleeping with these men just so that she could get back at them basically. and she's sleeping with wow. them without a condom yeah no. that because that's wild. what they want yeah to sleep with her without a condom I hope they, yes. I hope they, oh they, my they goodness. take care or they're on prep Ooh. is that a pun? no don't you know prep <laughs> My goodness. You don't know prep. And you don't know prep. <laughs> you don't know prep. Uh, you don't know prep tonight, nigga. <laughs> no, prep, it's post exposure prophylaxis. Yeah. Or pre exposure prophylaxis is prep. What's that? Um, to avoid getting HIV. So if, let's say, you had a, an accident, mm. um, then you take PEP, post exposure prophylaxis. It's 30 pulls. Mm. 30. Yeah, you take one a day. You know? <laughs> <laughs> Don't take them. <laughs> Don't go let the watch now. <laughs> yay, yay, yay. Um, yeah, you 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 take them uh, thirty uh, for for one once a day. So if anything ever happens with you, just take that. So do you take it before? That's prep. Prep. You take it. It's almost like so. There's two. There's pep and prep. And prep. Yeah, prep. It's pre-exposure prophylaxis. So some people. Um, just have take it like you know. It's also in a pack of thirty, but it's continuous. You can take it for like a year, two years, if you you're the kind of person who doesn't use condoms. And that prevents me from 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 uh, getting yes, HIV. It prevents you from getting HIV. Oh, and then shit. Um, Pep, you take it after an incident. So maybe you got raped or an accident happened. You take those pills uh, once a day. Jeez, man, where do you get those things? Uh, at a From clinic. the clinic? You get them at the clinic huh? or um, alternatively, uh, you get them at a pharmacy. Yeah. yeah. But what do you think about like a girl just spreading HIV like that, bro? I enjoy that pep talk. <laughs> uh... <laughs> no, I'm no, you, school. Yeah, you're schooling him. Actually, that's good. Yeah, I'm educating him. And that's good. But what do you think though? What do you think? That's fucked up. That's a crime. Listen to the crime. It's a crime, man. She must go to prison. It's mm. fucked up. You can't do that. You know what I mean? Like, you, knowing that you're sick... And yes, HIV, even though it's not a death sentence anymore, but no one wants it, mm. and it's a crime. Mm. It's a crime. Fact checker, please check for us. Um, is deliberately spreading HIV a crime? Mm. Uh, what, what do you think, Ghost Lady? What do you think? Um, I think, is it a crime when someone already willingly has sex with you without a condom? So it can it still be as much as to the other end, it's like I am infecting you deliberately, knowing that my status, but the other person also, also their responsibility to because they're an adult to demand that let us use a condom. So it means that also these men are maybe they're on prep, maybe there's something that they trust, you know, or maybe they, they or thing. they trust their moody or something. Mm. Yeah. So I'm just debating on the is it a really a crime? Because it's two consenting adults. I think it's a fact checker. Um, yes, it is. If it's proven that it was deliberately transmitted to one to cause them harm, then it will be seen as a crime. Especially if Damn. you didn't mention your status. Mm. Stop fucking hiding your statuses. Oh. Even shit. on WhatsApp. I wanted to... <laughs> uh. <laughs> <laughs> It's a thing now, eh? When I DJ, everybody... <laughs> I wanted to ask you, you know, <laughs> so you're dating someone, right? Yes, I am. And that person, your partner, yes. happens to kill someone by mistake. By mistake, okay. Yeah. Would you hide the body? Mm. Would, Would I you hide... help them hide the body? Um... No. You wouldn't. Ah. This is the love of your life, dog. By mistake, then you can go to the police and say, Ah, she'll get ah, yes. You put a put a put a I must, hey, must, it's a mistake. Ah. Oh, hey, must, it's a mistake. <laughs> oh, wow. I'm going to see that judge. <laughs> hey, cause lady, are you helping him hide the body? I'm helping. You're helping, man. You're helping, helping Naga. I'm helping. Now I'm in. Now don't worry. Like, I'm even giving you ideas. 
I've studied this thing. I watched the crime channel. <laughs> but now you're an accomplice now. Mm. Yeah, but there's ways, guys. There's ways to dispose a body, you know? For tell, us, tell, tell us. Tell us. Tell us. Ah, no. tell no. us. Give us the pep talk. Tell us. <laughs> There's liquids, guys. There's Acid. liquids. Yeah, there's liquids available in the black markets, you know. Oh, you can't take the black market. They do it for you, you know. How do you gonna how do you know the black how you do you, how do you where do you even begin to contact someone in the black market? Yeah, there's the there's the sites, you know, you find the people. Or you talk to people who know people, you know. There's people who know people out there. What must I tell you the person? Yeah. Like, let's yes, let's yes, phone yes. him. <laughs> Ah, okay, it's 082. <laughs> Let's call him. Ah. Fred Checker, are, are you helping him hide the body? I'd ask where where was the incident before I hide the body. Oh, what do you mean? The body's there. What the does it matter? Okay, okay. The reason now. I would help, right? But if it happened that, for example, the person was visiting, then people would know who this person was here and hiding it would be a problem. So that I'd have to go and report it, right? But if it just so happened at like a hit and run or something like that, then yeah, we could just discard the body and leave. Hey, Tato, yeah, no, you got a real one, eh? Hey, <laughs> Tato, yeah, you got a real one, boy. Got a real one, boy. Dude. Right Aye, that, bro. Hey, Why don't we just cut the Bo-bo-ni. body and leave? Ah, <laughs> bro, I ain't hiding shit, dog. Ay, 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 me, 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 I don't want to go to prison, dog. Now, lady, dog. I love my woman, but I ain't hiding shit, dog. <laughs> really, you can't. You'll be here telling us the whole story <laughs> by mistake. Happens, by mistake on the podcast. <laughs> yeah, it's content. <laughs> it's content. <laughs> I'm saying till it happens, eh? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, but. So you'd help hide the body dog? No, it he's depends not. On the, on, on the situation. It depends what? on the situation. Oh, what do you mean? What do you mean? Like, I mean, if you killed someone by mistake. Like, look, bro. I would help my woman hide a body if, say, for example, it was someone who attacked her. Mm. You know what I mean? And in self-defense, killed the person. But then we still just go to the police, right? I think it really depends on the situation. But if I'm going to hide that, you'll do crazy things, you know, for love. Mm. Yeah. Like you'll do, it, we can sit here and say, nah, that's, that's bullshit. That's would wild. you take life for her and say, okay, cool. When the cops come, say, I did it. No. Oh, you're chilly. <laughs> and then yeah, and she remains behind, getting, getting rocked by somebody. Fuck okay, no, never, bro, never. She, she remains behind. Ne- oh, for someone to come behind. Oh, no way. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Where's the body? Let's go take it. Where's the hole? I'll, 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 I'll bury a body any day. I'm not going to take prison time for, for anyone. I got me. Uh, Fuck, I don't know if you guys saw. Do you know CP? CP for my can... daughter, I could take prison time. Oh, yeah. For my daughter. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah my yeah. kids, I would. Ah, uh, that's a non negotiable. Yeah, thing. yeah. Nah, yeah. But for somebody else, no way. Bro. But that's someone's daughter. Yeah, the, her dad must take prison time. <laughs> Her dad was go not me. <laughs> her dad was go for Dita. Not me. Not me, bro. I don't know if you guys saw. Do you know Sim Pui can rap? Yeah, Sim Pui is a rock star. He's a rapper. Yeah, Siwe, 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 right? Was that your name? No, it's not Sim Pui. It's Pui. It's Pui. Same thing, man. No, it's Pui. Wow, dog. Okay, please rap for us, Siwe. Yeah, hit us like one of your, your songs. Do you want to beat? Do you want to beat? Or you want to do a cappella? Nah, it's fine. I'll do. Bro, you like a superstar in the making, bro. Yeah, Why, yeah, bro? You've got all the qualities, man. And when you DJ, you can give blowjobs for free. Uh... <laughs> yeah. Or when he performs. <laughs> uh... <laughs> yeah. So you guys will relate to this because it was that Dubai trip. So it's uh... ah. <sighs> Damn, this is recent. Yeah. You Never see on his TikTok. His TikTok is fucking bad. <laughs> Are you serious? TikTok. <laughs> What's the name on TikTok? Spew Matlang. Spew underscore 
Oh my tongue. Thank God. Yeah. So um, it's never thought I'd be this happy. Sweet life, sour worm candy. Looking this dandy. Cheap gin in Dubai. You should wonder why. It's body low shedding, sipping henny in the sky. A status update. You showed you thought it was a lie. No drinking on the lobby. Who thought I would comply? Staring at a Russian number I put in. It's plus Ooh, two seven. Ow. Thinking loud and looting. Hey. Reply real quick. I'm Paisel. Can't do young Paisel. A blue tick, but the nudes were a great gesture. Uber request. Description says a black Tesla. Who would have known I almost be up there with super mega? Can't I'm a Jose Ang Pegil? On my way home, but to Mama Sega Pegil. Is it as I'm so funny? Jelly, who I'm going to pay? They probably heard us talk, but it tripped. I say I'm a leak. Oh. Complete the bucket list before you kick the bucket, kid. Surrounded by people who pocket down you when they sleep. Never thought appreciating life would ever be this cheap. Let me speak. A catheter preventing all my leaks. Let me speak. A calendar reduced into a week. Let, Let me speak. speak. Who thought you ever witnessed me this week? Let me speak. I'm dying while she's trying to look on fleek. Let me take an eldo. True love is fun when you can lick your elbow. Till then, you're just dealing with a mad hoe. What she's bringing to the table is a bill that you pay for. Stop it. Hey, I almost made it to oh. Super Mega. Oh, yeah, I almost chilled with Super Mega. Oh, car was from your pair because you had the accident on your way to your mom's. Yeah, oh, bro, that is. Hey, that's dope. I got it. I got it. That's dope, dog. Damn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey <spirit. laughs> So the starter is not my clue anymore. <laughs> And this is it. Who we are rapping is. Don't include me in any of that shit. Actually. <laughs> what happens to the stats so when you rap? So you stats when you rap? <laughs> nah, I don't. I don't know why. Hey, it's, it's not oh, my cool. That is so cool. <laughs> that's not my cool. Cool. It's not a ring slam, my cool. That's not my cool. Let me speak. Let me speak. Yeah, you told the story. Let me speak. Let me speak. <laughs> Sit down. Let me speak. Wow, no, bro, that's bro. That's beautiful. That's yeah. a beautiful verse. Let me speak. Damn. And I, I want you to say che- cheap gin in Dubai because they smuggled gold in. <laughs> <laughs> Which was a great move, man. Yeah. Otherwise, you'll pay a, for a, a, a six pack of Savannah alcohol. is a grand. Mm. Like 1,000 rand for a six pack of Savannah. Legend. Guys, you had to go to Dubai. Like, just ah, be, no, crazy, that place is expensive. You must know your story. Dope, man. That's beautiful. Fucking hell, man. Wow. How, how would you rate him? Because you you used to be an MC. Right? No, dope. You're writing, man. Obviously, I, I think, you know, it's dope, man. Like, mm-hmm. I, I, that's a, a solid, that's a solid 7 out of 10. Because right, I'm not hearing it on a beat or whatever, but writing is 10 out of 10. Give him the last you line. Know, let, him, let, him, let him take over from the last line. Ah, Let's see how oh, dope yeah, he is. Yeah. Give him the last line. No, 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 no. <laughs> are, are, are you going to rap? I mean, I don't rap. You used to be a rapper. I, 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 no, 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 I, no, I used to. He's a rapper. Hey, you're late. So, you're late. Fusek, uh, you're remember, late. For sec. So, so. Hey, for sec. No, I find no. you in the pocket. So, <laughs> if I am fine. If I am fine. If I am fine. So let me expose. Mac, Mac does rap. Mac, uh-uh. Oh, oh Mac, hey. Mac, you do rap. When? I remember way back, Mac, you used to make me listen to your rap songs. Oh. oh. MacGyver, you've got rap songs. Let's go. No, play your song. Aye. Play your rap song. Aye, come on, you know. Aye, <laughs> nice one. No, 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 he does. Mac, Aye, you, just go back to your, your pile there. Play your song. Aye, which song? You rap, MacGyver. <laughs> Thank you. Like every time I try, okay, remember I come with MacGyver or we drive together. He's always making me listen to music. Yes, now it's your new music. But way back. Oh, yeah. back Voltrex, like Voltrex. Okay, let me go Voltrex. No, no, Voltrex. You, Voltrex. Even on, you even on this motherfucker, like Anna, so, what's up? <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's yeah, not, I took so, it out. I took it out. Oh, he took it out. He took it out. Uh, <laughs> took out his dress. No, Anna, that was so, nothing. He was Anna, rapping so. proper. Okay, yeah. let, me, let me call him because he's so. Voltrex, the guys who did the intro beat, we were in studio one day and I rapped. So nice. let me ask them to send me the song. Dope, man. What's your Good. rap name? No, I was just fucking around, man. <laughs> no, I also rapped on that track as well. So, oh, here's yeah. the verse. Let's hear your sister. No, I can't remember it. Mm-hmm. Like, it was ah, just... fuck. I know, man. No, no, no. He's got music. Mac, please. No, I'm going to my phone. Okay, I'll find the song. I'll play it next to you. Yes, okay. Yeah, but then we can also play my work one too. My work verse too. It's fine. Yeah, yeah. Can't wait. Uh, Speaking about music, how do you guys feel about Uncle Waffles, Bobby Cooper, and K.O. being nominated for the. Is it BT? What is it? The BT Awards. BT Awards. Shout out to Swaziland, man, for the nomination. Um, Uncle Waffles. Yep. (laughs) 
<laughs> people are people are not happy about that, eh? Why? That what it's happened? a Swaziland because obviously. I mean, she blew up in SA, SA, you know. But people now are like, but guys, she's Swati. It is what it is. That's true. And she, doesn't rip, she doesn't rip Swazi, eh? Like, you'd think she's from SA if you didn't she know. She writes pre-rolls. <laughs> <laughs> she, doesn't, she doesn't rap Swazi, so I'm like... But who's that? Hey, come back, come back. Hey, me have a pussy, I'm a pussy good. <laughs> so I don't normally uh, uh I don't normally uh agree with um what's his name? Barita's ex, ne? Ex yeah, what about him? I don't normally agree with him, but I agree with him on this one. He tweeted, Young Stana is the man behind two BET nominations and two nominees owe their success to him. Mm. Where would Uncle Waffles and KO be without him? Mm. Mpumalaga in Swaziland. Unfortunately, he possibly has the worst management anyone could ask for, whereas Tulu and Zeus are milking his features. He's got a point, bro. So... No, because Which KO part? Which also part? also KO got nominated as well because of Seth. Because yeah, of Seth, and that's Young Stan. Yeah, Young Stan. Yeah, I mean, yeah. That's yeah, I mean just, he kills it. There. Yeah, he killed it. He made that song. And then uh, uh, um, Uncle Waffles Adiwele. Adiwele, yeah. Mm. She blew up because of Adiwele. People think it's her song. Yeah, it's true, 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 true. And I remember when people were like, "Ah, wait till Adiwele dies off the hype; she'll be gone." So I remember that that uh, period. But let's give Young Stan his flowers, man. Yo, Young Stan, bro. Shout out to you, man. Oh, like, shout fuck. out, shout out, bro. Like, yo, did you hear his verse on hey, Nana Tula? Kabza, shout out to Kabza, that oh. Nana Tula. Oh, do you even call that a remix? Because it's just a totally different and, song. And the original is banging. You like? How do you even like? It's like trying to remix uh, Thriller. Hibari, Hibari. See, Google Gugu Gamesh. Hi, boy. Oh. Ah, see, 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 no, 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 wait, wait. Senzani? What? Senzani? Six wheel. Yeah, that's right. See, Google Gugu Gamesh. What? You know which one I'm talking about. No, 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 no. We don't know. What is it? Gamesh. No, 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 wait. Sija, Ubusha. Sija, Ubusha, Bait. Say that one. Sija. Yeah. Ubusha. Yeah. Bait. Say it. Kesho. Si kuku bush. I got pegged. Si kuku pegged and I pegged. Yo, bro, the way it comes, I just did that song. Yo. Yo, Kamza. Like, dog. Yo. I. But Kamza, bro. Mm. I mean, he just dropped Rekere right now, that album, right? And he's like, comes with, bro, I, what does he get all the time, man? No, I get he's got, um, he's running a China shop there. He's got like 100 producers that produce. Uh, he's got 100 producers. A, a chop yeah. shop. <laughs> but still, though, well, I mean, even even that's the case. I mean, he gives a direction. Yeah, and yeah. He's got the ear. Yeah. And also, Kamsa can make music. He's yeah. fucking phenomenal. Yeah. Right? Yeah. But that song, Anatula. Mm -hmm. And then when... Yo, Young Stana, bro. Young Stana, man. No, like, young guys, Stana is amazing. Young Stana man. is a generation. Shout out to KO as well, man. You know, it's easy to have a hit, but to do it cons so consistently. He's been in the game for like 30 years, bro. How long? How long, Swoo? 20? Yeah. 20, 20 years. years. Over 20 years. Hits after hits. Mm. Dog, Shout out to KO. No, no, shame. Shout, Shout out to KO. KO. Man. Shout out to KO, man. Ah, yeah, yeah. So KO, beautiful. KO, bro. Yeah, right? we always talk about, let's say, Bo, you know, who's this guy? Um, uh, I forget his name. I I Yeah, I <laughs> Which guy? But tell us a song, I think. No, no, no. Um... <laughs> <laughs> have water. Have, have some water. And I, oh, and I water. do have water. Have some water. Drink up. It's delicious. Ooh. We're patient. It's fine. The boys will cut it. Don't worry. Cast on your vest. Shout out to him. No, no, I'm always saying, no, no, we always talk about more cast, but it's like they are heading the hip hop game. But more KO, shame. <laughs> <laughs> it's Casper. So you see what happens when you come late. What happens? This happens. I'm, I become very slow. 
I'm even if one is not an age, age though. Early, that's why I'll end up saying, my, that's my woo, then the ta, you know? See, uh, no. Yeah, you know, I don't know. Yeah, you know, I don't know. Yeah, you know, Shout out, Shout out to Got So you're saying about Casper, what are you saying? No, I'm saying, no, no, I'm actually just bigging up KO because we never mentioned KO as the forefront guys like who've been pushing the hip-hop game, honestly. They have been consistent I don't even think it's years. hip-hop, it's just music in general. Yeah, true. Man. But obviously, it's just he is a rapper at the end of the day, you know? So I always talk about, oh, Casper New Vest, you know? That's that's the only oh, first name to mention. KO, give us, uh, what's that song? Karakara. No, no, no. The uh, when when he started, man, um, with the three guys. Tia guess. Tia guess. What's the biggest song? Tobo ami, Tobo ami. From then, dog, still rocking. Bro, he's been around. You're he's right. And you're right. Kanye doesn't get the credit. Yeah, like, he's his first, first uh, BT. This one. Yeah. This is his first. Yeah. Wow, that's wow. insane. Also, Pabi Cooper was nominated as well. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Shout out to Pabi. Nah, nah, nah. Bobby's whack, bro. She killed her own song, man. You know that song, the one with his mahu ta. And Kosa's on her daughter. Yeah. Beautiful song. Mm. Gabs as well. Beautiful song. And then she comes on, she just spoils it, and it's her song. <laughs> oh, wow. She wrote you haven't heard that song. Daliwam, yeah. Daliwam. Oh, Daliwam. Is it? Ah, yo, yo. She tried to remake the. Ah, yo, yo, yo. Mm, no, 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 no. You, you, you. you know that song? Yeah. Wait. Kaifas. Kaifas. Yeah, Kaifas. Matwale. What's it? Matwale, yeah? Oh, wow. You haven't heard that song, bro? Yo, yo. So you've never played that song? No, I've never played it. Bro, beautiful song. You must hear it. For real. And then Pabi ruins it. Yeah, it's beautiful until Bobby comes on. Are you for real? Bobby, I'm Kupanga then. How? If she ruins the song. No, Yams I mean, is the I mean, producer I'm, though. Yeah? Yeah, Yams is the producer. Oh, yeah. oh Yams, Yams is brilliant. Yo, Yams, yeah. yo, Yams is a god, man. He's brilliant. Yeah. Mm. He's super talented, Yams. Anyway, what else you got for us, Ghostlady? Um, guys, I got a story from um Utando, uh, Tando Tabete. So she has um gotten a protection order against Ulunga Shabalala. What? Yay. Yeah, it's quite a sad thing. So she accuses her ex of um incensed harassment, saying he's following her to a place of of residence, work, and even tailgating his way into his her residence, a uh, residential property. So she claims that she's living in fear due to Shabalala's strange and obsessive behavior, which includes calling her friends and constantly trying to track her whereabouts. Where's the ah. Marawa and all of this? Hey. Why are you come? <laughs> Shall I lie? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. So it's quite hectic. It's quite hectic. Oh, oh God. I'm stalker. I'm stalker. Let's go longer, man. Do you have his number? Don't you have his number? Nah, let Let's tell see. him to stop. That is not cool at all. I think yeah, men to men. What's wrong with him, man? <laughs> men to men. Tell him to stop. Yeah, you, you, you guys leave that. You think BS, it's true, though? Nigga. You think it's true? Why would she? You, what would it tend to say this? Is it in the paper? Yeah, or it's on an article. This is what's reported. But, but why would Tando just lie about Lunga Shabalala? Oh, I actually have Lunga's number. Let me call him. No, let's try and call Why him. would Tando lie that this guy is, is talking? Yeah, but why, how, so did that, how did that order. story come out? Who who leaked it? Who? So, well, let's call Tando and confirm it then. No, no, let's call, let's call... I think Lunga... <laughs> uh-uh. I think we must friends. call Lunga. I think let's just take it to the guy because he's the problem. Yeah, ring. Yeah, yeah ring. Oh, whoa. Because she's also Some she's also barring him from um, disclosing their um, electronic communication, which they've shared together during the relationship. Yeah, but who got the story? It's on an article. I can check. Yeah, so who sent it to the article? There's something off here. Just check our uh, fact checker. The source like of Lunga, the story, Lunga, Lunga's good looking man. He can have any chick he wants, bro. Ah, no, no. Good looking niggas also fall in love, fall in love. Let's be honest. So you think no, he no. was in love? If if it, if it is true. If, do, do you believe the story though? It sounds far fetched, man. Why? If, if, if Tando said it, if if Vele Vele or Tando said it, then yeah. If if Vele Vele she said it, then yeah. If she said it, then yeah. Wait, I mean, did he answer? Did lie? he answer? No, no, it's not answer. But if she knows nothing about the story, then of course it's a different thing. It's fake news. But if she said it, then. But I'm asking, how did it get to the papers? Who's the one who sent the? Fact checker, Skolusnet. Apologies for the delay. I was trying to understand exactly how everything went about. Mm-hmm. So, um, as you guys know, that Tando Tabete has a reality TV show mm-hmm. on BET. So, on the eighth episode of... Which this, no one watches. Terrible yeah. show, man. Okay, so... 
Under age. It's like a whole Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> it's an, it's an Instagram story, Nick. Yeah. yeah. And, yeah. Here's, and here's I, the thing. I love Tando, bro. Like, people think I have something against Tando. I, I don't. I tried I watching. genuinely love her. But when I watch that thing, man, bro, the secret to having a reality show, be real. Yeah. Dog, there's an episode where she's taking her dogs to fucking... She had a dog party, bro. Who can relate to that in Imagine. SA? In South Africa. In South Africa. Hey, rich people, man. Ah, come on, dog. You're rich. Do you have a dog? <laughs> I don't even have a dog, man. What no, no, my son has a dog, but I wouldn't <laughs> even... Like, that's not kind of content I want to, like, watch. Like She had a dog party. Yeah, bro. A whole episode. Yeah. Okay, as I was saying, mm -hmm. um, on the eighth episode of the show, the one that Mac does not like, um, she was no, she no. had the an event. The one that SA doesn't like. No okay. one's watching it. Okay, the She's one not that getting a season two. Then. That we're not forget. watching. Um, she had an episode where Lunga Shabalala was also in it. It was a party with all of her um, celebrity friends, and Lunga Shabalala was there. So it was said that the channel is the one that called Lunga to this party. So according to City Press, she then stated that she does have a protection order against her ex, which, re which was the reason why it was a bit, I could say, suspicious or uncomfortable at that party when they saw Lunga Why would Shabalala. the channel do that? It's a reality TV show, oh. so... It's understandable. But the person who leaked or the press that leaked the information about the um, protection order was City Press. Mm. Mm. Yeah, but you know these people, they go, they know these journalists. So they go there and say, hey, print this, you know, to get talkability. And yeah, because now we're talking about the reality show. I exactly. bet you some people are going to watch it now. Yes. Wanting to see you understand. that particular episode mm. with Lunga in mm. it. So you think she's lying? Ah, so I couldn't tell off, boy. Like, Lunga doesn't strike me as a guy who would do that, bro. He's also a celebrity. If it was just a nobody, yeah, I'd understand. But he's got a lot to lose as well. Well, celebrities are human, bro. And sometimes when people are, are enraged or angry, they do things, you know, stupid things as well. What is the, what, when you have a protection order, what does it mean? Like, basically, the person cannot come. It depends, I think, whether it's 100 meters from you or I, I don't know. How do, Does it state how many meters? Basically, um, um, avoid, like, yeah, like they can, can never you come to your yeah. space. Yes. Yeah. Ah. If it's your house, your your home, your area, whatever. So it's they must never be, they must always stay within a certain, like, radius from you. Oh, I need a protection order against all the celebrities. Huh? Why? Who's bothering you? No, I they want my head. Well, Who you wants need your they, head? They, all of them. You should stop talking about them. <laughs> that's that's how you get them. <laughs> stop talking about them. <laughs> Damn, bro. It's easy. Tuso needs a protection order against roadkill. <laughs> <laughs> and Spoon now. We're adding Spoon to the list. Ah, Spoon. Ah, no, no. He wants no protection wants order. Wants he wants the, the smoke. He wants, he wants the smoke. Like, he lives on it. It's oxygen, man. Yo, bro, people were hitting up my phone regarding, because uh, you talked about Spoon, eh? and you said action is a, regarding Uncle Herm, bro. Oh, Uncle Herm. Shout out, Uncle Herm. Uh, Come through first part two, man. You know? <laughs> oh, Uncle Herm. So we shot the episode like long ago, so I'd forgotten about it. Last yeah. week. And when people sent me the screenshots, I was like, shit, yeah, no, he really did kill himself. Eh? He did, actually. Eh? And it's weird because he came with the, the PR person and they were sure sitting right there. Yeah, and she thought, ah, we're doing well, Uncle Herm. <laughs> like, <laughs> they, they never well, said, I'll remove this part. Because <laughs> it has changed completely how people see him. A lot of people are like, I was actually considering warning this guy, but damn, mm. not, not anymore. Ish. And Uncle Herm is one of those guys you can't say eat your words because he's always talking. <laughs> it's too much to eat, man. Hey, Uncle Herm, you're cool. Remember how many times we tried to? Hey, can you ask a question? Ah, yeah. <laughs> Thank you, he was ready for you guys. Aye, aye, aye. Yeah, you were saying uh, fact checker. Fact checker. I was responding to the protection order question. Mm. According to the internet, um, it is there to prevent reoccurrence of um, domestic violence or sexual harassment or any form of harassment. Wow, yeah. So that's what a protection order is meant for. So you can't have a protection order against your fellow colleagues. Mm. Oh. Shit, what Unless happened to... Prove they've been Who's the soccer player? The one that's dating Natasha Tane? 
Uh, oh, Lodge. Lodge. Yeah, what happened to Lodge, bro? I think he was found guilty of uh, domestic violence or GBV, yeah. Jeez. Remember it assaulted his girl? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah, yeah. It was, then it, there was a case. Also, Anthony uh, from Man United, uh, the story came out that he was uh, assaulting his girlfriend. Hey, what's mm. up? Hey, what's going on, man? So with Lodge, now I've got the story here. It's like Lodge was found guilty of abusing his girlfriend, Fundiswa Matitibala. Yeah, so that's it. So this was at the um, Randburg Magistrate Courts. Apparently, the incident happened in 2020. Orlando Pirates released a statement say, uh, saying the club had previously charged Lodge and um, for misconduct and ordered him to pay a fine and also to do an anger management course. Mm. Yeah. yeah, that's that's all, but it helps and it doesn't happen again. Mm. I think he's learned his lesson. Shame, man. Like and then Pori, Pori's story just everybody's forgotten about it. He's gigging. Ah, uh, but he's at gigs where. Salah. But I did say, but I did say, it was on, on this platform. I was like, Pori won't get cancelled, man. No. The streets won't cancel Pori. No, Shem, he's forgiven. Yeah. yeah. But I guess she dropped the, 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 the charges as well. So what are people meant to do? Mm. Also, let's be yeah. honest. If she if she also, if the charges were still... What are they? How come they cancel? Yeah. yeah. Nah, but bro, that thing went away quickly. Yeah, because she and dropped the charges as well. She, she no. dropped the okay, charges. Okay, ghost lady, if that was me and Saul, if that was me and Saul, if that was me and Saul... It's then over. Was a yeah? band, it? It's over. Why? Why is it over? You'll just when be it, here. Why is it over if it's me and Saul? Unless the charges not. get dropped at this rate, it's about... No, I'm if saying the same situation. Listen to me, ghost lady. Same situation. If that was me and Saul. Yeah. And the girl drops the charges. Mm -hmm. Do you think people will forget about it? No, of course. Why not? No, I'm saying of course they'll forget about it. No, they won't. Are you mad? You'll be here. Are you Busy mad? Still getting the same views. No. Uh, do, you, do, you know, do you know if you've forgotten your followers? But Bro. remember, chillers won't cancel us. Exactly. No, chillers won't cancel us. Then they'll view. If there's chillers, then we're, we're going to get the views. Bro, we were, we were, they were going to castrate us, bro. They were going to hang us. Of yeah, course. The, the of industry. course, they'll say, yeah, I'm misogynistic. Yeah, so I'm asking why? Why? Yeah, why? Yeah. why? Why? Why is it like that for us and not Pori? Because remember what Pori does and what we do, it's two totally different mm -hmm. things. He makes music, right? That and, and people generally, everybody loves music, bro. And we, on the other hand, you know, share our opinions here and it rubs some people up the wrong way. Week in, week out. And that's what we do. And we love it. And some people will proper hate us for that. And some people will use that disguise they hate for the fact that, you know, we, 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 we created something from nothing and people, some people truly, that's what they hate. And we'll use all these other little things as reasons to hate us. So the, 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 the kind of hate that he would get versus us, it's a totally different thing. And that's just the world, bro. But don't you think it's unfair that uh, certain celebrities have a uh, uh, um, um, right of passage that we don't? Like we have to trade in a different way as opposed to other people. So people, other celebs can it's get... fucked up, yeah. I know what you, you mean. You know what I mean? But we're the special ones, hmm. you know? But don't you guys think that do, podcasting, okay, as much as you said, Pori is in music. You guys are in podcasting. They're cool now. Don't with, you uh, think? Tuli P now, ne? Yeah, no, she's getting gigs. She's They'll moving probably drop on. a song. Yeah. Tuli Pongona featuring my Pori sign clap. <laughs> Clap with my producer's old partner. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> well, still they tight, it would seem. Uh, but don't you guys think also podcasting is that strong that you've got like a, a followership that is that will be very supportive we to you? No, we, no, no. I'm not disputing that. I'm saying there's Tell different us. rules for other celebrities and there's different rules for yeah, us. Yeah, it's not a fair no, yeah, a, a level playing ground. It's oh, not yeah. a level, yes. Yeah, that's oh, what I'm saying. Level, bro. That's not true. at all. Some some celebrities can fuck up and they won't get cancelled. Yes, right? yes. Uh, I mean, like Somizu will never get cancelled. If there's say? something wrong or something foul or allegations come up, he won't get cancelled. He's the industry. There's industry darlings, bro, and we're not industry darlings. You know what I mean? So in order for us to, you know, when we walk in these rooms, when Zex Panduini invites us to a thingy and we go there, you know, you know, we go, we get all sorts of looks from these people. You know what I mean? Mm. Some are fans. But I'm not talking about other celebrities. Fuck them. I'm talking about society. Okay. Why do they expect us to behave in a certain way where other people, they don't? What do you mean? Like, like an example, when you say society expects us to. Society, that's what I'm saying. If that had happened to us, dude, we'd be dragged to the mud. No, no, no. But let me, on, let me be honest with you guys. 
who you're comparing yourselves to, they've been famous for being perfect. Hence, you have DJ Maporisa, perfect DJ, perfect music, perfect everything. You guys are famous for, for your faults. <laughs> bad, bad, bad. <laughs> Let's be honest. <laughs> you're famous for our faults. Yeah, no, you're famous. Exactly. Let's be guys, man. It's, 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 no, let's be honest. Let's be honest. So every time you do something wrong, it'll be like highlighted, you know, that what you expect. This is what my guy does. No, this no, is what but what I'm saying, thing is simple, what I'm man. saying, there's a hunger. Porous. There's a, there's an appetite for us to fail. Oh, no, yes, are, that's me. why I'm there's saying because, because yes. Yes. you put it so beautifully. Yes. Oh, yeah. There's that's a mess true. Of, yes. And yeah. Everyone is waiting for, you know. One of us to fuck up and it's like, yeah, there's a witch hunt. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah, of course. I think, of course. You, to be honest with you guys, that what is happening is that you expose people's insecurities. You expose their wrongs. You know how within this life, we want perfection, perfection. So every time what you guys do and what you expose is that we are just humans and we have faults. And no one wants to see like people, their bad side yes. being shown. So that's why they will hound you for your honesty. Whereas they are probably doing far worse. Let's be honest. And they will label you as the worst, worst. And no. So. And we're the purest. Yeah, we're imperfect and it's working. And we made it work. Thank and you. Some people just hate that. Yeah. The fact that these guys, they're imperfect and it works. And it works. Like do, it and works. they are loved so for we it. Don't, we don't try to be perfect. Smooda, what do you think, Smooda? Grab the come, mic there. Come, Smooda. Grab the oh, mic. What do you Mr. think? Mr. Smooda! Smooda, come, come. Break, break yeah, it yeah, down. Yeah, break yeah, it yeah. down. Because you've been, you've been uh, in the industry for how long, Smooda? 13 years. Now. 13 years. Yeah. So what do you think is happening? Please, I can't, I can't understand what's going on, bro. Oh, man, some people are just big. Like... Pori's character is big. Whatever he may do or do, not do, people are still going to love him. For his music, right? Because he doesn't expose his ugly side. It's only the people that work around him. Look at how many people come and say, he stole my song or he cheated me. Still, people just move away from that. Because he'd fuck up and drop a banger tomorrow. People forget about that story. Focus on that. So we need bangers. Yeah. Tina. Well, and That's if the anything, they probably buy PR, man. Because it works for them, right? Nothing they do ugly is exposed. And there's not a lot to hate on Porter. You don't know his opinions on certain things. You don't know uh, what he, how he, his views on the see, world. You I don't see. know all of that. All he is is a musician, and that's what he does. He puts music out. Yeah. So the, there's not a lot to hate. Why, why is there another standard for us to behave as opposed to other people? Hey, man, you exposed your flaws to people, Thank and you. they recognize you for that. Yeah. Him on the other side keeps his personal life personal. Mm. Only situations like these where um, Tuli is going to say, yo, this happened to me. And a lot of people are like, ah, but really? Because you were one of the first people to say, nah, he didn't do it, right? She's just trying to fuck up his career. And That's it. Did I say that? Yeah. Oh, you shit. Did. On what episode? <laughs> 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 ah, man, but it's, ah, Fuck. I don't get that, man. Ah, it doesn't accept, sit well with me, man. You have to just accept it, bro. We'll always be treated differently. Because what, what we do is different. You know? And we carved the whole different path that a lot of people are now following. But you'll be crucified for that. So here is someone, and I'm not going to mention names, right? So I'm not even going to say Pori. But here's a celebrity who shows um, a fake, non-realistic uh, image uh, to the public, right? Mm. And they get worshipped. And then here's other people, I won't even call us celebrities, you know, but other people who show their imperfections, where they've gone wrong, and they get crucified. How does that make sense? But we get crucified by the industry. Society loves No, us. even the worship. public, dog. Even the public, bro. Uh, how so, I kid you, who's cancelling us? It's, it's, it's not the celebrities that are cancelling us. Yes, we know they hate us, but whenever we do something wrong, The media wrong, doesn't we like us, but like people love us, bro. No, guys. Society loves us no. more than, more than please the explain. Big celebrities because people can't relate to that, but people can relate with us, and that's what they love uh, about us. Here's the thing. You always share your opinions about people. Pori doesn't. So people wait for you to do something bad so that they can be outspoken. And for that, people are going to either love you or super hate you for sh your opinions, because your opinions will be people who, are, who agree with them or your views. So the problem is we have opinions. Don't. Yeah, uh, that's podcasting essentially. Uh, Perfect example, right? Opinions Maybe, are polarized. For instance, let me say Casper. You bash him, bash him, bash him. Don't you think the moment you bash fuck him. up, he's going to be one of the first See people to say, yeah, there's your guy. <laughs> but it's not bashing, bro. It's the truth. 
Yeah, your truth. Pori doesn't share his truth about people. Yeah. So that's why not a lot of people would want to hate on him. Yeah. You know what I like, mean? Music says like you call ice cream a spade. people who sell he ice doesn't. cream. People love ice cream. People love music. And that's it. But if you started now, if the ice cream man started grabbing a mic and telling his views on the world, then people are going to hate the ice cream guy. Like, what the fuck? That's a foul view. Even though he's telling the truth sometimes. So that's the thing. Mupoto just sells music and music is music. It's a vibe. Fuck it, it so from now on, we're just going to play our music on the podcast to be safe. No more opinions. Unfortunately, <laughs> no more yeah, opinions. the yeah. chillers don't want, sh- um, they, they want your opinions. So exactly, that's, that's why people sold. love us. No, no, I get these people that love us, but I do. A lot. A lot, yes. Again, you I mean, know, we're about to hit, to hey, we're about to hit a million, guys. Yay! Hey. 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 How much are we on now? Shout out, shout out, uh, CP with the blowjob. That really boosted. <laughs> 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 we had 975,000. Jeez, that's insane. So, that's was wild. the blood job for to get more subscribers? Nah, nah, it was just a dope concept idea that we thought would be dope. <laughs> you know? There's a lot of things. There's a lot of things we could do for numbers. We could show you on face. That would oh. get numbers. Yeah, definitely. Actually, yeah, let's get it a million now. Show your face. Yeah. <laughs> 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 you see? No, I'm going to Pop's show. That's why I look good. All right, what else you got for us, Kosli? Um, I've got a... Okay, so I saw this tweet, guys, from Prince KB. Ne? And, okay, let me read the tweet first. It said, um, I had sex for the first time at age 14 with a woman way older than me. The older James motivated this, claiming I had, I need to prove myself. Not one brew asked me what my dreams and aspirations and encouraged me to focus on my talents or school. Not one. Right. So I wanted to ask you, like, guys, like, do you feel like you men lie to each other? Yeah, you punch each other yeah. to do things yeah, that yeah. you look back in your older life and go, but that was unnecessary. No, that's our job. Yeah, but guys just, yeah, yeah. such a time. Such a time. The time changes are just... Oh, everything that is time. mentioned there, his father should have done that. Not his friends. But we live in a society nah, that a lot of women are raising kids alone. Hey, damn, yeah, they damn. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> you just you just hit another thing. You see, we need we, we need fathers, present fathers. We yeah. need present People fathers, active and present. Because you're yeah, so that when your boy is back, Juta, your hero, your dad, you mm. know, um, has instilled these certain things. Exactly, and you're like, that's bullshit. Yeah. When your niggas are like, oh, smash her, you're like oh, that's, that's where peer pressure comes from. I mean, we juta each other all the time. Ah, man. gents will juta each other all the time. Like, like ah, boy, boy, this girl wants you, and you know she doesn't. But you're like, ah, boy, she wants you, boy. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. No, but don't you guys, okay, how many, like, we live in a society where men, like, women are raising kids alone, right? So isn't it for other Not men anymore, to step hey? in? Not anymore, hey? What do you mean? Our know, generation is our changing. Our generation is changing. Then, I'm from Quebec, so someone called, so. oh, you're from Quebec? We didn't know. Yeah. <laughs> No, I'm not from Quebec. You just landed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I heard a voice, someone calling me by my 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 old Gassi name. I'm like, someone from Forslows here. What's that Gassi name? Um, rap name. <laughs> what is that rap name? Listen to the story. <laughs> so I'm like, oh, damn, someone from Forslows here. And the guy literally flew to PE to spend time with his daughter. Oh. And we live in an age now where our generation is changing that narrative. A lot of our dudes are doing really well in, in actually raising kids and 100%. being present. You know, it may be a baby mama situation, which is unfortunate sometimes, but guys don't let that get in the way of, mm. you know, uh, being there for their kids. So mm. we must be careful with that narrative, you know? Mm. Yeah, a lot of dads are present. Yeah, the I kids know. may be living with the mom, but they are present in mm. their kids' life. No, no, no. Shout out to is to we're knocking out that at the park, bro. Yeah, right. shout out to mm. act- you know, present dads. Because so, we were raised by moms and we don't yeah. want that for our kid because we know the challenges of being raised just by a mom, especially if you're a boy. Any kid, you know, needs both parents uh, present. So mm-hmm. shout out to all that. But what dads. were you encouraged on the soul that by other men, because, okay, yes, you say you were raised by just your mom only, mm-hmm. that you look back and say, ah, uh-uh, there was just a no-no. I was lucky, man. I, 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 me, me and my friends weren't really into Jutana. Um... You know what I mean? And I just lied to them, told them I've lost my virginity. Just yeah, before. I also lied about like, losing my virginity. Like, I've lost my virginity. Remember, I was recording because I had a home studio. Yeah, yeah I smashed her, but mm. just lied. You yeah, know me I mean? too. I lied, yeah. Yeah, because I no, told you them. When did you lie? <laughs> yeah, 
a chance just live to avoid that pressure. I miss that. I missed it. <laughs> We've all lied, guys. Let's be honest. We've all lied. Eh? Everyone has lied about virginity. Yeah. To avoid, I'm actually to putting you in a corner yeah. or always reminding you of, yeah, do this, but, do this. But okay, do are, are you guys not going to be that amachita who who, who who push other like young boys to do things that you like? Ah, nah, I no, lied man, about this. Ah, yeah, come dude. on, you're a child, man. You must do everything, my man. You see, you are that you are that uncle that will push a, a little kid <laughs> to do things. <laughs> must rock, chief. Are you gonna, are you gonna, when would you like Ziggy to lose his virginity? Ah, Ideally, yeah, yeah, yeah. it's fourteen. You see, you see, you see how Prince yeah, Baby said at fourteen. Like you think son. fourteen? Are you gonna ask him? Hey, fun. We'll say a lot. So a shy, boring. You gonna be like? Is fourteen a, a, a good age for a boy to be losing his virginity? No, I think fourteen, that's a bit young, man. No, yeah. guys, yeah, virginity, man, is that too? That's young, man. That's like, young, for me, it's man. like okay, I'm done. Yeah, pep, I'm fourteen. Who grade seven or grade eight? Nah, like, that's what's not the point? Good. You know what I mean? Like mm. legit, legit. Let's be really honest, right? Anyone here is having sex can have a kid and take care yeah, of it. Yeah, but no, because obviously what's the all the guys here are older. Being... So what's the, the what's the reasonable age? Because you ah, 18, 19, 17, 18, 18, 19, yeah. 20. Yes. What happened to the bases? Remember there was base one, base two, base three, remember? Yeah, like a kissing what's stage. Like you're just kissing. Base right? one is kissing. Yeah. Base two is the tits. You feel the tits. Base three is fingering. Base four. You guys don't remember. Hey. Um, <laughs> wow. Hey. What's this now? Puck Town. What in the Puck Town is this? <laughs> what in the Puck what Town the is going? What is this? Okay. Base, right. base one piece. What okay. the fuck? Okay, teach us Puck so, Town. So like, you stuck on base four figuring for, for how long? <laughs> yeah, yeah base five is, yeah. No, nah, base five. Yeah. There's base oh, five. <laughs> nah, man, virginity can wait, guys. Hey, let's be honest. There's so much time. I mean, look at us, you know, late bloomers, but there's so much time to catch up and have all the sex in the world. Late Why bloomer, you having sex? I, I just say yourself. <laughs> yeah, yeah, well, give me, I'm a late bloomer, but, you know, like, it, life is good. You know what I mean? Like, why, dude, you're in school, homework, and you're, you're having sex. <laughs> like, like where do you find the time? You're having casual sex and you still need to deal with homework and yeah. passing and getting re good results. And, yeah. Like, there's no... Kids in high school have no business having sex. Ah, uh, uh, guys, but we're all inquisitive when we're young. Come on now. Yes, Remember but we're all and wiser now. We all know Mama and Papa. We all know what we're doing. But I, we're I, all I, and no, wiser. No, no. It was time to sleep for 10 hours and then we play for five minutes. Then it's time to sleep. No, I mean, it's sex can wait, man. I remember Mama Li Papa. <laughs> And the kids used to force me. There was a, guy, a kid who used to try to like, you play mom. I'm like, no, eh, I want to be a kid. Eh, eh. <laughs> yeah. So you'd, you'd play. You're one of the kids. Yeah, I always want to be a kid. Mm. And I, think like, he, I think he had an eye for me. I think that's why. I think, oh, yeah. Mm, yeah. I was thinking about it. So I'm you like, were never a mama? No, I didn't want to be a mama. Because it would be like, oh, mama, no, baba, fane baye kamere. And do what? <laughs> and do yep, what? Hell no. And no inventor. No inventor. Oh, yes, yes. Oh. You know, my Kelly Sana. What's he doing? Yes, I'm going to But don't you think it's because Papa. of, you know, kids. <laughs> ah, when. <laughs> 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 but don't you think it's, it's because of kids growing up in a small home so kids will be aware of what mama and papa do and that's why they want to reenact it with you know when they play play Generally. Yeah. yeah but that's what I'm saying we are inquisitive as children so you can't it's, no no if you don't know do you think your kids are inquisitive now because they don't know they have their own space they play it's not like they you guys they have their own room they yeah. don't know that you're having sex they don't know about you having sex and doing things that are for adults yeah right mm -hmm. I, I caught him watching Yippee Yip, uh, what's that Uncle Waffle song? Yama, yama, yama. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah I'm like, hey, that, that, why are you watching that, this? Yeah. He's like, no, I wanted to listen to music. <laughs> <laughs> what's wrong with the video explicit or something? No, but I get it from that video, you can go to another explicit mm. video and they're shaking bums and you know what I mean, twerking. You must do your YouTube. You must no, I deleted it. No, no, you must just... give him YouTube kids. Yeah, you... yeah, yeah. I gave him YouTube kids, but he found the real YouTube. Bro. Oh, it says. Mm, mm. Yeah, no, my son does refer. like, mommy, I'm don't shake my pam pam. I don't like to see people shaking pam pam. You must have find That's working. Yeah. yeah. So. All right, cool. I want to play a game with you guys. You guys ready? Oh, there's a game. You ready? Uh, I love games. Let's go. All right, cool. So, Pinduka, here we go. Would you rather hmm. kick a dog or take a punch from Mike Tyson at his prime? Fuck you. Where's the dog? 
you. Okay. No, you, you want to walk cool? I can die. I, like, for real, a boxer? No, I'll kick a no. dog. You kick your dog? Yeah, damn, I'll kick a dog. I'm, 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 I'm Zuma. What's his name? Strong, guys. West Ham guy who kicked the cat, remember? Kurt gotta, Zuma. I'm yeah. Kurt Zuma up in this bitch. Cover Linja. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. Nice one. <laughs> no, I'd kick the dog too. You kick the dog. No, guys, I don't like violence, and I, I, I'm not taking a punch from no. Oh even Tyson. a girl. Mike Tyson was even a, beast. a girl, guys. Dude, like, I'm scared of violence. I, I look like I can beat up a girl, but I ain't taking no punches. You've ever been in a fight? Yeah, a long time ago, and I don't like it because I get very aggressive and angry. I'm that win? type of girl. I think so. I did win, you know, because well, just a push. It's clear when you won. What do you mean you think? No, 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 no. It's not, it's not I think. No, no, no. I, I won because I just pushed. And it, it just made... We're not saying the fight. Giving birth, yes, you pushed. You just pushed. Oh, child. no. We're not talking about the fights. Like, I wasn't we're talking fighting, about the fight. I wasn't what? fighting my baby. No. I'm saying the I loss... I won because I pushed. She just pushed. <laughs> She's telling us, as you were being in a fight, she's telling so that's why it was not birth delivery. A, no, no, no. That's what I'm saying. It wasn't even... I can't even say I won because when the fight was about to happen... The, the push I did, like I pushed her It was off. powerful. So I pushed her away and I think she realized, okay, maybe this is not something I want to do. So you've never been in a fight? No, no. Because that's not a fight. Yeah. What, what is it about? JR? <gasps> Imagine. No way. Come on. No, no. That was a long time ago. Man, what kind of question is that? We <laughs> get punched, kick a dog. Or yeah, punch. I'll kick a dog any day. I'll kick a dog. No one is taking a punch from Mike Tyson. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, you wanna, you wanna, you wanna, okay. Oh, oh, yeah. Okay. This is the Kabangin question. This okay. One. Let's give us, give it, make it hard. Make it this hard one, for this us. This one is hard. Okay. Simpu has got to ask on this one as well, man. Let's go. Would you rather mm -hmm. say your ex's name? Mm hmm. Or your girlfriend's best friend's name in bed. <laughs> Ask you shall receive. <laughs> <laughs> Ask you shall receive. I am fine. I boy. I think that this is more harder for a chase. So it's so it's gonna be hard for you. Hmm. Mm. Uh, Would you rather one. say your ex's name? Yeah. Not her best friend's name. Why the best friend? Yeah, because like, she's current. Because she's friend. current. Yeah, so it's a bit, a bit of a like, weird It means one. why the best friend? Mara, if you say ex, that means what? Kabanga about the ex. Yeah, rather than the, the best friend. Mm. The best friend is... It's current. Sabonana. Yeah. Well, like, umuntu o sempilonye. Imagine. Ex has umuntu o sempilonye. Untabi saying, manje. Yeah. This was him. Mm. Best, best. Oh. Who's in Tab saying? <laughs> Who's in Tab saying? Like, am I missing something? I just, I just, I just said. Or just it. random name. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. Zipu. Zipu. Uh, what, what would you do? What would you do, Zipu? Um, at this point, um, since I'm going to go to my son, I'm going to go no, nah, I'll say um, the friend's name. Yeah. Me? <laughs> Why? You want the smoke, ne? Oh, I want the, I want the smoke. Can you show now where they come with the smoke? In oh, he's heartbroken. Remember smoke. they left him in, 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 in hospital. Smoke. They left him in hospital to die, smoke. remember? It's hey, man. smoke. I'm a Thomas and I ain't saying it. It's smoke. You've got a lot on your chest. I'm a Thomas and I these days. No, remember he got dumped while he, after accident. So, very right uh, now. Uh, he didn't get why, dumped. Why are you dumped? He, the chick just didn't show up. <laughs> She's hospital. still coming. Uh, maybe because some manga is special and some cholera. No, you're not manga. You forgave her. You forgave her. No, That's no, no, the no. problem. I tell you, no, never do. Don't. No, no. He he did. He forgave her. They are back real? together. Why would you be with that? Imagine, honey, sis. Wouldn't why would I do that? Because I'm shy, man. Born. Ah, we're not trying to violence, fools. Last one. What would you do, bro? <laughs> Ah, ex boy. Ex and your friend. Ex friend, ah, so friend. She will never forgive you. She will never. Thank you, your best friend. Never. Yeah, 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 yeah. Never. Never. You can't never. recover from that. But she can't. forgive you for thinking maybe. Hey, but ex is bad as well. Oh, man. best friend is horrible. Yeah, best friend is horrible. Oh, best friend is the worst, bro. As a woman, I'd prefer you saying your ex. Yeah. You're my best friend. All right. If someone offered you one billion, 
but a random person on earth would die, would you take it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. A random People are person. dying every oh. day, bro. Like, how? Like, if Number I don't take the billion, a random person's gonna die at that moment. <laughs> exactly. At that moment, then I say no. How? I don't want someone to now die. Now, we are in Maybe it was, the, it was meant to be. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Would, definitely, bro. Yeah. Give me a would you rather. I'm, 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 I'm out of would you rather. Give me one. I don't ever would you rather fruits with the head, man. Come on, bro. Come on. You're the king know. of puns. Come on now. Nah, man. Uh, puns and yeah, would you rather. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Huh? Yeah. I need to get You would you rather. Who's got a would you rather? Smooth. Smooth. You got a would you You look rather. like you, you're a man with would you rather. Ghost lady, you got a would you rather. I, I'm trying to think of one. I'm trying to think of one. Mm, think. We'll wait. <laughs> you, you love the silence, ne? No, let's wait. I mean... <laughs> Just like Man City is going to wait for their Champions League trophy. The wait is over, boy! <laughs> the wait is over! We're recording this on Saturday. What time does the game start? Champions of Europe. What time does the game start? Uh, what time? Nine. Nine. You think you're going you to win it? Oh. Yeah, obviously, bro. You reckon, eh? It's not obvious. It's going to be a tough game. I mean, Inter is not an... Just a, you know, a walk in the park, mm. but it's our time, man. And we've learned the lesson from the last final we're in, where we botched it and and, and just overthought the whole thing, overcooked. The hey, whole man, when you're coming onto onside, uh, the soccer podcast we have, you must come through. Ah, no problem, I'm coming. Or do you think people are tired of seeing me and you? Ne? They tired. Yeah, I think they tired. They tired. Yeah. Oh, they tired. Yeah. Here's a deep one, guys. Okay. okay. Let's go. Would you rather have um telekinesis, ne? Or um, telepathy. What the fuck? <laughs> Why? What is that now? What is that now? Telekinesis <laughs> or telepathy? <laughs> telekinesis or telepathy? Mm -hmm. What's telekinesis? Um, the ability to move things with your mind. You know when they move okay. spoons okay. in movies? And then okay. telepathy is... The ability moving. to read minds. Telepathy. Yeah. <sighs> telepathy. Telepathy, yeah. Yeah. To read minds. Yeah, why would I just want, want to move things with my mind? How's that going to benefit me? But I think I have telepathy. I'm a very good reader of people. For real? Mm. Like For energies. instance, huh? how do you read our minds just one by one here in the room? Good energy. That's why you guys are here. So what about all the people who are no longer here? How did I you read fit their to minds. Read them? I, read, I read their minds. But you would have read their minds before <laughs> hiring them. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it was but it was okay, okay, okay. <laughs> anyway, um, R.I.P. to Clive Barker. He passed away. Yeah, he passed away. Yeah, man. man. Rest in peace, man. Mm, he brought us this team, the team that you have um, in front of you there. He yeah. was the coach. He's the guy, bro. Mm. Shout out to Clive Barker, man. He's the only one who's won an FCON, eh? Yep. Clive Barker, eh? Yep. Legend. Yeah. Jomani got close, I think, but Clive Barker, yeah. Anything else you want to talk about, my dog? Shout out to uh, Ricky Rick's mom. She wrote a book. Oh, wow. Yeah, um, it's like letters that she wrote to Ricky mm. and stuff. I haven't bought it yet. Please, our uh, fact checker, help us with the name. Just uh, Google maybe Ricky Rick mom book. So shout out to 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 to, to her, man. She so went the to, book is about her letters to Ricky. Yeah, she went to Mount Everest, you yeah. know. And, uh, yeah. Shortly after he passed. Shortly right? after he yeah. passed and while she was climbing uh, Mount Everest. Because um, there's a lot of things Ricky would ask her, uh, you know, personal things about the past, etc. And something she never got to address. And she just uh, laid it all out in these letters to Ricky, to her son. So, yeah, that's beautiful, right? Yeah, very beautiful, man. Ricky Rikesh. The book is Dearest Mariki. Dearest Mariki. Dearest oh, Dearest My Ricky. You, it's not accent oh, Mariki. Yeah, uh, yeah it sounded... M-A-R-I-K-Y. It's Ma M -A? Mariki. Yes. Oh, Mariki. Dearest, Dearest Mariki. Dearest Mariki. Oh, that's My Ricky. Sorry, my bad. Yeah, man, that's the book. Hey, Ricky's passing was like, hey, man. Strange, man. Oh, that one, yeah. And I remember, like, it hit hard, man. Oh, yeah, I remember when we we you we were shooting your music video, yeah. Um, for oh, yes. Nyasfela, so yeah. it was a studio shoot, obviously. At my Josie, shout out to my Josie, man. Shout out to my Josie, man, and uh, at my Josie studio, or whatever. And uh, it's 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 obviously in an office like park, mm. and opposite was Ricky's office, and that's mm. where he had killed himself. It was just so mm. a studio, eerie it's, being there. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, the studio at the mm. studio and Cotton Face offices as well, mm. just his business um, offices and studio. Hey, hey, Ricky, man. Hey, How long has it been now? 
I don't know, man. Okay, hey, yeah. you know, I was thinking about the other day, Blackie, man. Yeah. I was thinking about Blackie hey, the other day. Man. How long has it been since we lost Blackie? Like a year, a year and a half. A year, a year. A year and a half. It's a cold months. case. Still nothing, eh? When did we lose Blackie? What month? December. December. 2021, hey, right? Man, it's crazy. Shit, we lost Blackie in December. Hey, 2021 yeah. even. Oh, man. Oh, for those who don't know, Blackie was uh, part of Black Studios. Yeah. yeah. Not Blackie the artist. Not the case, artist. No, yeah. no, 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 no. Yeah. Our Blackie. Anyway, anything else you want to talk about? Um, That's it, guys. I'm good. Mm. Yeah. Mm. How are you? Help us. <laughs> I only have one now. You only have one? Yeah. Why? So you don't greet it. Um, it's all I can afford right now. Ah, no, ma. Can she see him? Can she see if Naga's favorite shirt? What happened? Why did you? No, I'm, I've, I've, I've downgraded a bit. My my daughter is older, so she doesn't need that much. Your daughter? Yeah, she's turning one now. Oh, oh wow. do, you, do you guys remember? Like, I was pregnant around this time last year, so I. Just, Damn, you were pregnant. Yeah, I was about to. <laughs> I forgot that you were pregnant. Eh? Yeah. Damn. But don't you remember how easy my pregnancy was? I wasn't I wasn't a, a hassle, guys. You know? Oh, uh, very you, good. You, you can't guys be traumatized. You, you must be a hassle like pregnancy. <laughs> Even if you are, you can't be a hassle with us. Your colleagues will work. You can't be a hassle. No, oh, but, colleagues, hassle no but colleagues also help, you know, come through. Oh, wow. Oh. <laughs> Naga came through, yes, but or oh, in rather. But like, come on, you can't be a hassle to us. No, they can, you know. People Do you want to have another one? Another one. Kid. A baby. Mm. Not now, not right now. I think I'm good. I have a daughter and a son, guys. You know, mm. how much more happy can you be? I want Do you want more. another one? Yeah. You've always said, though. Yeah, my son is not make sure that one is. <laughs> That's just because he's, he's just like his mom. So you just need another... So you want a boy. <laughs> need another one, Chad. Just to be sure that. <laughs> the boy will name goes on. Yeah. Why, 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 what do you think? Well, why, why, why? What do you mean when you say he's not sure? He takes off this. He's very soft, dog. He's super soft. He's super he's soft, a dog. kid, man. He's a super... He's that's smart. The, that's the best men. Best men come out. You see, the ones who are soft, they become the best men. To, um, uh, in he's older not, men. He's not a menace like a boy should be. Exactly. Like, he's, he's it's not, not a problem, you know. But it's cool, don't you? That's Mari, good. you can see girls are going to run rings around him, dog. No. I will learn. We'll toughen up. What will hurt no, him? No, no. That's why you should, as a dad, you toughen him up. Actually. That's your responsibility. Now, lady won't do that, yeah. Yeah, that's your responsibility, Mac. But he's still going to grow, bro. Mm. Remember, all of us, like, people change, you know? Like, I was a bully as a kid, you know what I mean? Apparently, like, when I was young, young, young. But I'm, it turned out fine. Kids you a bully? No, like not in, in a toxic way. You still like, bully our time now. You know? Yeah. You yeah. still bully our time. Yeah, we don't have a, we don't have much of a choice. Hey, man, it's we, we get <laughs> See what Tom Smoot came here. He needed to recover. It's we don't have much of a choice. Yeah? boy. All right, man, we're out of here. Uh, make sure you check out Titim Bar. Uh, we dropped oh, the beautiful, man. yeah yeah Shout the out. like dream yeah, Zanzi Cribs so yeah yeah, yeah we dropped it on Saturday make sure you check it out let us know if you still want some more because uh, that was like a what is it called in TV a pilot a pilot the pilot yes, yes. is Shout there out. another one coming at no the chillers must decide oh okay. so if you guys like that content let us know and then we'll keep uh, churning out more of it so will it always only come out on Saturdays or are we looking for another day for them I agree Monday it's us ne? yeah Tuesday soccer. we're working on the soccer it's going to be 3 p.m. yeah uh, we we're still working on some behind the scenes technical okay. stuff. Good. But in the future, Tuesday, it'll be soccer, which drops at 3 p.m. Right? Uh-huh. And then popcorn and cheese. Fuck popcorn and cheese. Are oh, flying, no, Wednesdays. Bro. Wednesdays oh, bro. are made. Yes, flying, right? Wednesdays are made for popcorn and cheese. Yes. 3 p.m., guys. 4 p.m. is, I mean, Thursday, it's us again. Yeah. Celebrity. Friday, it's Ama Piano Unleashed when he comes back. Yeah. So it's only Saturday and Sunday available. Is it? Mm. So Unless you drop it in the morning or something. What happens to... Okay, what are, what are you planning for Sunday? Sunday we're planning... I've got an Mjolo show that I'm thinking about. Mjolo? Yeah. yeah. Mjolo? Yeah, like hey. about dating. Okay. But what, but what happens? Tune in, you'll see. Okay. <sighs> and then I'm um, also thinking thing. about um, a podcast for Ama 2000. Like podcast and chill, but for like a younger audience. But they're already occupied. Wow, the pressure. The pressure, huh? You reckon? Yeah, when you say podcast and chill, but a young version, 
Yeah, because we don't we don't relate to the young market, right? Like, I'm but you'd be surprised how many young people are watching this. But I know what you mean. Yeah. yeah. Okay, that's dope. Oh, you, you know, who do you have in mind? Do you yeah. have anyone in mind? Uh, uh, major, major, major Steez. Major, major Steez, yeah. We tried. What's his? What we tried? Uncle Vinny, Uncle but he's Vinny. yeah, he's, he's, too he's too busy. Too, uh, yeah, he's too busy, man. So we're thinking of Major Steez and a young lady. Um, let me get a name. So we're thinking of that. Busiswa, well, but it's all trial and error. Like with huh? Busiswa Herimbi. Who's that? His fact checker. Yeah, oh, fact shit, checker. fuck. I don't even know his fact checker. Fact checker could be a ghost. Kandi, what did you employ her as? <laughs> Do you want to huh? be a ghost? On the show? On the Amma 2000 show? No, she must be on screen. You want to be on screen? Yeah. Uh, well, one of my telepathy is ringing now. <laughs> No. Are you telling me? Hey, Yanda Woods. Yanda Woods is the female. Oh, Do you know sweet. her? I've heard that name. I also don't know, her, but yeah. So that's you what I'm thinking. You also don't know her. Mm-mm. So who, who recommended her? Majesties. Oh, dope. Oh. Yeah, okay. oh, and another one. Eh? Mm-hmm. So I had a meeting with um, uh, what's his name? Uh, Likau Drip, right? Last year sometime, and Sibu Mabena. So my thinking. Because like a lot of people have been complaining about the chillers market, like it's not working out. The idea is dope, mm. but the app is not working out. Okay. Um, because you just go, you upload your business, and then after that, not much happens. Like it people aren't trading. You know, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Okay. So I was thinking about starting a chillers market TV show, right? Okay. But it's like Dragons Den, essay version. Oh, that's dope. You get it? That's dope. You get know what I'm saying? And then who are gonna who are, who are the dragons gonna be? Uh, Lukao said he'll be one, mm. and then maybe we get like a Zintle, because mm. she's a pioneer, mm. and then we get someone else. Please vex these dragons, eh? yeah, yeah, like proper dragons. Uh, yeah, one of my but boys, it's just a thought. It's just a thought. One of my boys was complaining, <laughs> Inga, uh, the guy who owns Ascent. Um, the, you know that thing I wear. You say I'm a referee with the A, uh, that label. So. One of the dragons on Dragon's Den yeah. invited people for a, a dinner. Yeah. Hey. The bill, I think, was 6K. Yeah. Hey. And then he drags Inga to the side <laughs> to split the bill. Uh. Drop that. Oh, 3K, 3K. And that's the thing about the dragons on Dragon's Den. What? So please vet these dragons. Since ain't going to do that, bro. Huh? Since they're not going to do that. Uh, <laughs> what? Yeah. Split the bill. Ah, Zinka would never. Okay, yeah. so you got Zinka in mind. And She's Lukao. a dragon. Yeah. Look how different dragon. I don't know who else. But I think three dragons are fine. Yeah, yeah. Three, 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 three is fine. But the show is complicated. Like, there's a lot of uh, paperwork that needs to happen behind the scenes. So if anyone knows how to conceptualize a show like that, please drop us an email. Mm. Podcast at thisismagg.com. Just uh, the subject must be Dragon's Den. Oh, okay. Yeah. And then we'll take it from there. I think... Okay, but you're not going to call it Dragon's Den. Yeah, no, no, you no, can't no, no. call it's it. Chiller's Market. We'll call it Chiller's Market. Oh, yeah. yeah Chillers Market. Oh, yeah. dope. That's dope. Can't but shout out to the Chillers, man. They're showing me so much love with my music video. Oh, yeah. 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 Yeah.
They They're staged. staged. They're staged. Ah. I mean, okay, okay, okay. Why would you do that? Imagine if someone comes to you in a mall with cameras and says, here's your phone, show it to your wife. And wife, here's the phone, show it to Saul. Why would she do that? Why would I do that? Appa- apparently, Black Studios have footage to show that it's actually staged. Ah, fuck. It's but staged. we still want him. He's funny. He's funny. Yeah, yeah. As a, yeah he's, just, he's a good host. He's a good host. No, so, yeah, so Black Studios... <laughs> Oh, okay. You got the receipts, my dog. <laughs> oh, that thing's staged, man. Come on, man. Yeah. Let's be real. So, yeah, yeah. Anyway, we out of here, man. Podcast and chill, yeah? Peace, yeah. Boom. Podcast and chill, man. Uh, you Bye. guys off to Pops Pop's the show? Yeah, we're going. Yes. Oh, man, I'm off Enjoy. to Bulukwana. Already we're come, late. What's, a, what's the time? It's half. We're late because of so. It's quarter to eight. Hey. Maybe we're just going to go home. Pass the lens on, please. Uh, speak with your chest. There's a mic. Speak with your chest. Pastor <laughs> <laughs> Jen. We are here, man. Podcast and chill. Tabang, what's up? Bye. Peace, we out. Oh, yeah. Start the podcast with Tabang. Do you know yeah, he's right here. Bye. Bye. Welcome to Black Excellence. Do not fear. For if you do, just sip on some grandeur. And if you still do, ask ourselves... What would Mapapunzi do? Parama chilla, itlesha, le figi. Bungo yig, even if when they ask you, how sabi do not fear. For if you do, just say, Anistivi. This is the medicine of censorship. This is the pill. Which one is that one? Podcast and chill.